Hello ladies and and frantic developers, in crunch time we return to Dead Cells. It is now the Hello Dark is my old friend update for everybody. It is live for everybody as of today. It, uh, didn't, I didn't even have time to make a beta <laughs> run of it. That is how quickly these people are de uh, developing and making changes and new things for this game. We're going to resume the run. I have no idea what the effect on a actual run is other than you still can resume it i have no clue whether this is going to be any good there was a damn decent amount of damage on that filthy asshole a disgusting animal and i just uh yeah split. just make these assholes bleed them doing a lot of damage because i have seven points of strength i believe that is the reason why that is happening these freeze grenade and then the the magnetic grenade. The magnetic grenade should uh, do really good, really well. It should do good against the filthy flyers. Still don't know where to go up there. Still have no idea how to reach that. I mean, uh, getting maybe the amulet that lets you jump a lot. Maybe that's the way to get up there. It just feels like there's something. There's something up there. Okay, that did not work out that the, the way I expected, but I am cool with it. You can reach that area so that I don't think I can reach that area. Block! Ha! May you bleed it! I guess I can reach it now with the. Alright, alright, that, that's how it works. With the chain, all I need to do is get up there with the chain. I just completely forget how this entire shenanigans, the entire thing works. Oh yeah! Get magnetized. You got wrecked so hard by my ability to chain you down. Laying out those chains of love. Okay, let's just go in here. This, this is becoming really quite ridiculous. There's a feller down here that deserves to roast. I'm roasting everybody. Like I am diversity in comics. Hell yeah. I am the greatest. I am the most badass. Weird possessed armor. That was BS, getting hit by that. Uh, I do see, like, uh, my, my health total, not the greatest health total. If I get hit in any serious capacity, I shall perish in horrendous, horrendous pain. So, I am very much hoping to avoid such a fate. This is me avoiding a terrible fate. Just roast my enemies, watch them explode, maybe get something amazing out of a chest. That'll be fantastic. I don't know whether this ongoing... Uh, I am assuming that this actually would be the the darkness update. And I'm in the graveyard with the darkness update, even though it's an in-progress run. Anyway, let's check out this impaler. It looks pretty damn badass. I think that the fire thrower, while amazing, I love it. I think it's time to maybe let it go. Poison target throws a grenade. Burn with a die. I think I like that better. Or maybe just have both. May it might be time to let go of this blood shield. Although, truth be told, yeah, let's let's go for this. Um, since I have, I think this would got slowed down. Maybe it is possible. Since I have so much strength, I might be able to block even the freaking watcher at the very end if I ever get there. Uh, so maybe not. Maybe not let go. Let's see, how much damage is this? Uh, I'm not... I'm not... I'm not 100% uh, positive about this Impaler. It does decent damage, but damn. That uh, flamethrower was something else. We have one of these fellers. Just corner the shit out of them. Oh yeah, take five dozen eggs, put them in the bowl, beat the shit out of them. What do you get? Penis! Exactly. Jerks. That uh, arrow going up is pretty damn helpful. I mean, the damage is pyrrhic. It is laughable. That is, uh... It helps. Well, you were supposed to explode all by yourself, not exploding to my face. We have a friend here that gets totally frozen. Alright. Uh, so far, it feels like it's easier. I could be completely wrong about that. I could just projecting. I'm projecting, trying to find something that's different and is completely the same. I do enjoy the fact that that 
Uh, Impaler does some badass damage. And it will be... Actually, no, I don't want to descend there just yet. Let's uh, leave that alone. I resent the fact that I got hurt by that guy, though. And this dude in the middle is kind of pissing me off, only slightly. Impale, impale, impale! Alright, there we go. Wonder how we'll do against the Watcher with this kind of build. Do a little bit of murder on this man and move on with life. Hmm, I do wonder how this is working out. Ooh. A flamethrower turret, you say? My skills are garbage. My skills are total garbage, so it is probably not a good idea. Magnetic grenade is doing the, the crowd control. I have crowd control options. The While it could have a strength upgrade, then that would be fantastic. I have these skills that make the enemies... I am controlling the enemies with the skills while doing the real damage with my strength. My strength! Okay, block that garbage. I am assuming that the bleed scales. Oh man, I get, get critted to oblivion. I am assuming the the bleed scales from the block with your strength. That will make a lot of sense. Let's see if we can block this guy. No, I am far too strong. I got him super stunned. It's too strong. Too freaking strong. Let's uh, control these dudes and just destroy every single one of them. I know this impaler, I am still ambivalent about it. Seems fine-ish. That's a lot of damage, I would say. Certainly a lot of damage. It is fine-ish. I still don't know whether it's better than my flamethrower. It definitely doesn't have the delay that the flamethrower has. So there is that fantastic benefit. Jerks. I do like the big, fat, super awesome Oh wow, I took two of those. That was super dumb. Slaughter this guy that has been hurting me. I don't know. You guys point in the comments whether it is not just doing damage. You have to hurt the asshole that hurt you. If you don't do that, you're not going to get your health back. And I am inclined to believe that. Uh, I just don't have any evidence as of yet whether that is true or not. But I am inclined very much to believe that and to operate under that assumption. And that is exactly what I did. Hope that uh, you verified as much. Trust, but verify. That is my my policy right there. You can block. Thing is, you block one, but you get four attacks into your face. So the shield really should work a little bit more reliably on being able to block everything that's incoming for that period of that period of having the shield up and then if the damage is too much then it breaks your guard that's how it should work i feel i'm just a schmuck playing video games on the internet i ain't no no designer Ooh, hello finally we get an upgrade it's been pretty damn uh pretty damn that's the key pretty damn whatever the hell ward is trying trying to find Hmm, force shield. Treats a force shield when you parry. Now in front of you, the visitor, the victims explodes, inflicting. I think we want this. The damage from the bleed. Scars is the word I was looking for earlier. Um, the bleed is very much. It's nice and all, but I don't think it's as good as having that invulnerability period after we parry because that solves exactly a problem that I just got done bitching about, which was. Putting up the shield, and yeah, you block one or two, but the others get through, even though you're still during the parrying uh, animation. So, find this, and this is the teaser to uh, Dungeon to Come. I guess we'll just double jump past these stupid, uh, stupid spikes. They are so OP in Dead Cells in the graveyard. They're super overpowered. Please nerf. Thanks. Anyway, let's go down through the key area. It's kind of the same distance, honestly. I could have just run back here. There was a strange freeze there. I don't know if it was noticeable in the video, but that was a very, very upsetting microsecond there. Anyway, I'm going to top myself off. Because I don't trust anything that might happen here. I'm going to go in, freeze these jerks, and just impale the crap out of them. 
And to do like I do in the brother, I impale everybody in my path. Freeze you. Actually, that was not a freeze, that was a slowdown because he was getting magnetized. There. I do like this build, though. I am very much liking it. It is a worthy build. I am behind it. I support it at a theoretical level. Well, I wish I had not taught myself up. Oh, yeah, this is exactly what we need because the Watcher will just cream our bones into fine paste if uh, we get hit a couple times by him. Most of the time, actually, is the damn tentacles is what does a lot of damage. I am attacking this guy from entirely the wrong side. I should be attacking when it's uh, against the wall. So feeling kind of dumb about that. Block! Oh, yeah. Pretty nice. Just gotta get better at it. This, uh, reaction time is difficult. Get frozen! I'd like to get you against the wall, please. It ain't happening. It ain't happening. It's just not happening at all. <laughs> it's late at night. Don't. Don't judge me for all the foolish things that I keep saying and uh, the completely vacuous commentary. Uh, it is the last recording of the day. Unlike my norm, I am recording kind of close to bedtime. Freeze this jerk. And uh, I think it shows. <laughs> it's just resorting a little too much to just repeating what I say, but with a little bit of a tune to it. I don't know if it shows too much that I'm being really, really dumb. Oh yeah, I am, I am freaking... I can't believe you. Uh-oh, yeah, I'm dead. Uh, I was a moron and I healed instead of leaving. I can't believe, though, I blocked that. I, it doesn't give you time, it doesn't give you time at all to block the, the super hit when you get hooked. So that was a very, very unceremonious death. It was extremely cursory and just finding a mook that I did not deal with and then I was dead. I even got that, uh, that grace period of not dying immediately. Hey, the force field uh, shield, let's use it. Uh, you weren't all that good, were you? No, no, I guess I was not. Thank you so much for pointing that out. Alright, so this is our official first um, darkness. Enter the darkness or butthole madness. I think that's the actual name of the update. Butthole Madness into the Darkness. That is, I'm pretty sure that's the, the official name. So, on our first beautiful Butthole Madness into the Darkness run, hopefully we can do something great. And I shall simply, since uh, I do know that they have it, altered the out, the, not the outline, the layout. Yeah, I think this is this is more fun than the rapier. The rapier, I don't know, man. I am kind of not fond of it. The rapier, I, I, I have a bit of a, a negative bias against the rapier. I don't really couldn't tell you why. I think it's because of the hitbox. It's a pain in the ass to hit. It's a pain in the butt to hit flyers with. And it kind of irritates me. That's probably why the rapier is not one of my favorites. Even though it's a great weapon, it's not one of my favorites. I would like to use this whip, only because it exists, but scroll of power, you can't uh, uh, you can't argue against that. I want the health, I really want the health. I am a, a freaking whore for doing more damage though, so... I toggle back and forth, I realize this. Wrenching, rip, fire, brands. We're going to keep what we got. I don't want any of those things. Uh, I toggle back and forth whether they're focusing... Ooh, nice. This, uh, this is one of the more fun skills there are. Super duper fun. Uh, to finish that thought, I toggle back and forth between going ham on health and going ham on strength. I think if you are in the very first level and you find a power scroll, we want to go to the promenade indeed. But let's um, explore a little bit more. There should be at least one more scroll unless they change that. I have no idea what might be different now. Hey, there we go. I might simply go to the exit to get us those uh, time doors. Might be worth it. I don't want to do the ossuary. I don't want to go through those areas. I want to be a little bit more methodical than that. And go the standard quote. That's between quotes. The standard way. Go to the promenade and then the ramparts. If, if that's still how it works. And then, after that. Okay, so there's a place to go through there. I'm going to go through because sometimes there's an item behind it. Uh, but I have no intention to go to the ossuary. 
So teleporting at least nowhere. So let's go to the promenade. I'm pretty sure that I have seen everything there is to see. Maybe I should have gone with a quick bow, especially since they changed it. Maybe I can talk. This guy has something new to say. There for a while now. All right. Can I kick it again? I will be very appreciative of kicking it again. No, I cannot. To the promenade. Hey, now there is an animation of going up the stairs. Amazing. Let's go down. Keep this thing, the cells. I just continue putting tiny, tiny amounts of cells into little things. And no even, uh, not even a reason to go through that. Into the promenade we go. Wanna explore the way a normal run would be explored. Which means... I seen you know, normal progression is what I meant. Okay, there's nothing up here. Uh, which means going to the promenade and then the ramparts. And we'll see what happens after that. I ain't in no hurry. <laughs> Although, I might only do one run of this update about the, the way things are going. It is pretty silly how the elemental update only lasted me for like three runs. Pretty damn stupid. Not blaming the developers, obviously. Just saying. I'm just saying. Uh, I just didn't have time. Why am I not using my amazing super hook? I'm the captain. There's no reason to mess with those guys. They simply keep going forward. We got some guts here. Uh, I mean, of course, there's the reason of having more cells. And I should maybe go for those cells. But if I have a good chance of getting to a time door, I'm going to do it because they're liable to contain... Really? It's all close? Six seconds away! Are you kidding me? What a load of crap. <laughs> this is very... Very unadvisable, the way I am choosing to ignore these guys. There we go. Um, ouch. Don't appreciate that. I'm pretty sure that this is the entrance to the place, uh, although it's not. The broken bridge is not here. So, what is the entrance to this place? Uh, I'm curious. Ouch. You can actually... Uh, <laughs> so. okay. I would rather just stop dying now, please. That would be fantastic. There has to be a... Scroll at the end of this. Oh, it's actually a uh, shop with yet another scroll indeed. Give me that good stuff. Gotta get the health. I am uh, too much of a coward. I love the War Spear. The War Spear was awesome. Have not had this for a while. Uh, this is a no brainer. Always grab that. And we're going to go with the War Spear. I'm a fan. And I have the cash for this. Well, what am not? And plus one to strength. It makes a million points of sense. To have that, we're going to swap that because I usually have the the buff on that on that key. Can't believe I didn't get to the damn uh, time door by five. I mean six seconds. What a load of crap! Go, 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 go. Uh, Impaler, fantastic stuff. Ooh. Of course, not a very nimble weapon. Far, far, far from nimble. That is the way to the old sewers, I would assume. I don't see any upgrade on the... There was an enemy down there, though, so... I don't know. Maybe it's not the way to the old sewers. I think I should go back and make sure that I'm not leaving anything behind. Mm. After playing this game for quite some time, I am devaluing murdering everything in our past. Not saying that it's a bad idea. Just saying that... It's not completely necessary for a successful run. Murdering enemies is so you can afford more things and so you can unlock more things. Not so much to have a good run. To have a good run, find all of the upgrades. That's what you need to to focus on. It's a fantastic destruction of everybody. Love the impaling war spear. The, it's not the impaler, it's the war spear, but it is an impaling weapon. Oh yeah, get wrecked, bitch. Uh, two enemies at a time are so much fun to wreck. Continue going this way. What the hell is the deal you here? We had a fantastic chest with the fire torrent. Double damage. No thanks. I will pass on that. Go back. And now I have basically destroyed every chance of finding any other time door. So not going to get my panties in a tizzy here. I would like to find that ridiculous evil thing that always makes my life so hard. 
Rock. Come over here. Actually, let's get over here. Get no money. No reason to murder those dudes. Hmm. It's, I think the cooldown for the corrupted power is lower now. 15 seconds recharge time. Down for 8 seconds. No, it's still the same. I don't know. But it's just time flies when you're having so much fun slaughtering your enemies. That I did, I did not realize. I like checking this because it's the easiest way to make sure they not leave a scroll behind. To check out the icons on the map. It's absolutely perfect. No, that is not working out for me. This impaler super bad against flyers. This means that probably means that I should be focusing on getting rid of this force field shield. I mean, though the shield is great and all, the flyers are just too damn annoying. Too annoying to get rid of with the current skill load that I have, which is nothing ranged at all. I do have the hook. Does this give you? Uh, does this lead you to the prison depths? It does. I don't want to go to the prison depths. If the ossuary is as bad as I've been reading, I don't want to. I don't want to touch it just yet. Let's just go to the rampart. Uh, well, I did read in the patch notes that there is more variety in the ramparts now. Whatever that might mean, I don't know, but I am eager to find out. Nine cells. I can improve something. Have I improved the impalers thingy thingy? Let's just put them somewhere. I should have put them in the in the vine grenade. I was pretty impressed with the vine grenade. I thought that what it was pretty neat. So we need more health upgrades, and we need, definitely need more strength upgrades. We have strength three thanks to the uh, hook. Or is it the... No, yeah, it's the Corrupted Power. So we're keeping that Corrupted Power, I think, all the way through. I would be remiss to let that go unless there's something absolutely incredible that uh, incentivizes letting go of that Corrupted Power. Super power up, super awesome. Thingy my bub. So... Yep, okay. <laughs> Never mind, don't, don't, don't pay any attention to... It was just a malfunction of the communication between the Goopa and the armor. That was what happened there. It was not complete idiocy. It was me trying to control uh, armor through Goop. Okay? Okay. I took you with my amazing premise. The premise is I bring out my giant spear and you collapse in a pile of blood and guts. I think that they like this premise. I'm pretty sure they will invest. Okay, also very much like that the hook interrupts. It doesn't just get people to you, it interrupts whatever the hell they're doing, and that is extremely helpful. Okay, we need to be careful with this filthy monster. He said while botching it completely. <laughs> oh jeez. Ah oh, jeez, man! Kill all these monsters. I am just looking for them. Looking for them beautiful strolls. That's all I live for. But yeah. Oh, jeez. I did not think that you reach me. That was bullshit. I'm just going to heal instead of going down for... Going down for extra damage. Ow. Okay, we need to kill that ultra super jerk. Alrighty. No, I meant to look away. Eh. Maybe. You know, maybe. Block. Are we fantastic? Let me find you, let me destroy you. What you got? Emeries burn when they die. Death orb is great. I think I am ready to let go of the grappling hook. Even though the grappling hook, I love it. The death orb, it is something else entirely. And I very much, I really need a ranged weapon. So, uh, that is actual damage. No. The <laughs> cursor is a troll item. Uh, and uh, we're not going to go for it. Cursed Sword, best troll item in a 22nd 17. Mm, fantastic. Just money, right? It looks like just money and cells down there. I don't think uh, there was any any blueprints. That, that orb did nothing, but that is because my skill level is slightly below average at this point, I would say. Especially you just continue pumping that, that strength. Uh, I'm very much hoping for 
You know what? I might go get both back for the grappling hook because this death orb is completely worthless for the current build that I have going. Look at that nightmare down there. Yeah. Well, I would rather take the damage from that and take the damage from the charger. Alrighty. Please, stop. Stop now. Okay, so we have all of these disgusting flyers. They are extremely dangerous. They will absolutely obliterate me. Oh shit, did not even realize that would happen. Oh, 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 okay. Oh, that was a wrong call to make. <laughs> to enable that. Okay, get everybody get poisoned. I like how they get away from the poison. That's pretty awesome. Smart little suckers. Oop. See, it's just not working out for me. But uh, the death orb, it is doing a little bit of work. Man, that's massive cooldown there. Um, it is doing some work. There. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just slowly <laughs> descend. There. Some health too. That's fantastic stuff. I need it. Eat some delicious eyes. Oh wow, the shield dude just outright prevents you from doing a damn thing. Alrighty. Yeah, I might go back for that grappling hook. It was so good preventing enemies from being a pain in the ass. So let's do that. It was right there. The Death Orb is fantastic. Right now I have level 1 skills. The Death Orb is garbage at this particular moment. Even though it was pretty good against the flyers. It's just trash against everything else. So, not going to focus on that. We have definitely have a strength build going on here. We have lots of health upgrades. And we have tons of strength levels, so it should work out quite nicely. And since I am in no hurry whatsoever anymore, I am just going out of my way to kill everything in, in my path. Obliterate you. No. I am blocking like zero times, so that might be telling. Uh, maybe I need to have it in mind more. Uh-oh. No, 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 no. I don't want to get super destroyed, please. <laughs> Thank you so much for complying. Okay. Hmm. The Impaler or the War Spear does not attack behind you. Something worth noting. Let me just block you, please. You get stunned. That's good news. Seems like a good place. Interrupt! <laughs> Beautiful stuff. This is totally the way to the Broken Bridge or whatever the hell it was called. The Black Bridge. Uh, it's not the Broken Bridge, it's the incomplete one in the Black Bridge. Continue exploring, of course, because I think that we still are due one more wonderful. So really cannot wait to get maybe an electric whip, something, uh, some throwing knives, anything that will allow me to shoot up will be super duper great. Correct, assholes. So yeah, the shield also does damage to the flyer too. It, does good damage and stuns them. How about you look away? Thank you. Well, that was terrible. <laughs> I was feeling all smug and suddenly I fell miserably. Oh, yes, more guts. Delicious. Nutritious guts. Huh. Come on, that up, get some more guts. So damn good. Continue exploring. I'm pretty sure that we have reached the end, though. And I did get uh, quite a few scrolls. Oh, we're not at the end yet. Never mind. Hey, my first skills upgrade. Give me that good stuff. Oopla! Really need to have in mind the shield more. I really could use more shielding. Ouch. Wow. Fantastic. <laughs> Somebody. Shove a corn cob up my ass, maybe that'll wake me up. Okay, nothing down here. Get stumped! It's not what I intended. Not what I wanted at all. I meant to block. I did not mean to get that, that buff. Fool, fool, fool. Dumb fool. Bloody jerks. My only real way to deal with these guys is to block them repeatedly. I'm a little resentful about that. Doesn't even, doesn't even stun him. 
<clears throat> has to be something worthy at the end of this. I do have 25% reduction of uh, projectiles, so we're going for that for sure. Another scroll for sale. Sign me up. I have plenty of health. Level 5. Let's keep them even. Strength and health. Plus one to strength and nutcracker. Yeah, it's faster too. The nutcracker also does a stun. Have more than 75% health. So if you open with the nutcracker, nutcracker. Let's go for it. Go, 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 boom, 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 boom. It's going to be pretty. Oh, plus one to skills. I'm not focusing on skills though, but probably better than this grappling hook. Especially now that I have the Nutcracker. Is it? The grappling hook? I don't even have the money to afford it, so never mind. <laughs> but is it better? I, probably it's better simply because it plus one to skills. Let's go to see what's up there. Uh, it will give me decent. And it's also... Kaboom! It's also... Oh man, let's, uh, let's see if we can get one of these idiots into the abyss. I will very much appreciate it. Whoopla. Well, that was, I am resentful that that did not work. See ya! Jerk! It's nice to be you. I'm completely humiliated. Boom! <laughs> I do like that. I think I like that better than the Impaler. Uh, for single target enemies. I don't know, so there's a nice scroll. Extra skills. They, this really continues making a case for that Vine Grenade. Alrighty. That was poorly time block indeed. I'm just going to wait here. Hoopoo! Fully worthless. <laughs> Let me read a secret here? Nah. Mm, something you know I would like would be maybe different moves depending on whether you're crouching or hitting the up arrow or up in, the, in your d-pad or whatever you use to control. That would be, I think, uh, the next addition to the combat in Dead Cells because it gets a little old to have the exact same moves all the time to attack. Not necessary, but I think it will be a fantastic addition to maybe do a bit of a sweep or some kind of like downward slam with the actual weapon. If you hit up, it's an uppercut and it sends the enemies in the air, stuff like that, you know? I think that will be a fantastic addition to an already excellent combat system. Combat system. So should I go... Should I go for that vine? I'm pretty sure that I can afford it now. I think I'm going to keep with a grappling hook. It's if only because... I'm only able to afford one thing, so I'm going to afford something that I really want instead of going for something that is eh, slightly better, I think, maybe. Let's not do that. Let's focus on what I can actually improve my run with a great deal. So might as well get this because it's only one point away. I have the Nutcracker equipped, so let's give it 5% damage. What else do I have? The shield... The Force Shield, but it's already upgraded, so let's just keep putting those points. I guess this is almost there. Uh, the Magnetic Grenade. What else do I have? I have the Buffer, and I have the Grappling Hook. Neither of those can be upgraded, so let's just keep putting points in there. And maybe I should focus now on getting the, the money, the last money unlock. Simply because money has become way more harder to hold on to. It's very easy. Very, very easy to run out of money now. They changed the economy system, so you have to spend a lot more money to get what you want. Let's see if they have upgraded the incomplete one. I would not be surprised at all if the incomplete one now is not nearly the same pushover as it was. We have six... Ouch. We have six um, points of strength, so we should be able to block this guy pretty easily. I thought that you were not able to block that anymore. I'm pretty sure that you were not able to block that anymore. I'm pretty sure that I read that in the freaking patch notes, damn it. Kaboom! Kapow! Kututo! I am slightly resentful that that just happened. Let's see if we can. Oh. We can block all of the all of these guys' shenanigans. Oopla. Oh really? It didn't interrupt the attack. Let me just heal through that. Please heal, thank you. <laughs> All right, let's not be absolutely idiotic and dumb. Ow. Maybe, let's see if we can uh, block... There. I'll block that. Block that garbage as well. I don't know, I don't think they have buffed it at all. Uh, I'm pretty sure that he's exactly the same. I'm just being bad. <laughs> I'm just being pretty terrible. Thing is, 
that the shield definitely makes those attacks so damn trivial. Super duper trivial. I'm not going to not going to complain about that, that's for sure. Alright, we got a fantastic victory right there. Mm, I don't see any unlocks in there, but there could be something. We did make it to that door earlier, so it's not something that I am terribly interested in I'm doing again. There's probably some other unlock, it would make sense that there's a, always a random unlock in there until you stop being able to unlock things. But maybe it's just the only way that you can unlock the vine grenade and that's about it. That is not, no other benefit to it. So here's what I'm looking for. I'm looking for a weapon that go, will go in the secondary slot. This force field is great. Shield is fantastic and all that stuff. It's not working very well with my current sensibilities, which is maybe just go 100% on the offensive. At least it blocks that really easy. Like, it just blocks in its tracks, no problem whatsoever. Okay. <laughs> At least I interrupted it and stunned it. Kaboom. Oh, okay. Uh, going all the way over here. Also would really appreciate some... I can roll through this. And go down here and then go in. Fantastic. That's a new addition, I feel. I'm pretty sure that... Ouch. Okay, let's make the test. Yeah, it, you can heal. It does not have to be revenge. You can heal the thing. You can heal that damage, regardless of what did the damage to you. I don't know if that's conclusive proof. Maybe that is only when whatever did damage to you is dead, are you allowed to regain the, uh, your health through through a different enemy. So that is not 100% conclusive, but we have verified that at the very least in that case. We are able to heal up 11,000. Another scroll, sign me up. What is lower, health or strength? Health is lower, we'll go with for health. That is my current policy. I don't know if it's the correct one, is the policy that I am adopting right this moment. Because I have gotten burned far too many times, sometimes literally, by not having enough health. I have all the strength in the world and then I just get completely destroyed. Oh, I thought that the Elite would, was the fat guy, and I was like, eh, I'm not going to do that. But no, the Elite is the little dude. Let's attract every single one of these guys with my amazing animal magnetism. Here, come come here, friendo. Okay, ouch. These guys are so fast, you, you want to underestimate them? That is your last mistake. See, you can't even, you don't even have time. To smack him. Get smacked. Thing reduced by 10%, drops a bomb, blah, 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 blah. I have the best, absolute best amulet in the game, as far as I'm concerned, so not interested. And hey, the grappling hook is awesome. I'm just saying, I need something to kill things at a distance. Let's go through here. This guy's stand, stunned, but where single target combat is concerned. I think I have a fantastic build going right now. Filthy, filthy jerk. Get you out of there. Come here! Kapoof! Got you completely destroyed. Really should have blocked. That was so dumb. Did not realize that the elite could have been easily blocked. I would have had a much easier time. Oh yeah! Here's Johnny! You got completely owned. By my amazing charge to the door. All on Miami style. Uh oh. There it is. Awful, awful things there. But I can block him. Now we get close. Ah. Ouch. Ah! Shit. Oh, that was terrible. Come here. Alright. I need to get better at dealing with these dudes. Don't be silly. And grow a willy. Let's play that. Or I would have exploded. Okay, fella. Hello! Here's <laughs> the nutcracker. Kaboom! Oh, yeah. So much damage done. Love it. Mm, not doing all the damage I am hoping for, though. It still takes three hits to kill those dudes. Uh, not with a damage buffer. Damage buffer takes, I think, two. And there's a skill. Up. Mm, well, there's a damage buffer also makes you able to block better. 
Like say uh, you will not, your guard will not break at a much higher threshold. Uh oh. Let's go. go away. I don't want to face all that junk. Oh, yeah, I love rolling in and just hooking people up. It is my style. That is not what I intended to do. Thankfully, I had the presence of mind to get a nice block. It is nice to have the Nutcracker's ability to stun enemies that are full health. It makes them so much easier to deal with. So I'm, a, I'm a fan of the Nutcracker at this moment. I would appreciate more damage out of it. Damn it, that is, I feel, we asking a little too much. Can destroy jerks. This dude. I love also that the grappling hook, the cooldown is so damn short. It makes it super fun to use. A rapier. If you think I'm going to pay money for a rapier, you are sadly mistaken, my friend. Like I said, I have a irrational bias against it, so. Hello, sir. That needs to be blocked because. He was stunned that he not, was unable to get that thing. So I wonder what's in there. I need to find out. I'd like to find out. Can I find out? That This is new. This is different. I like it. This might be our 12 minutes. So we need to get here at the 11 minute mark. At the 11 minute mark we need to get here. That is not impossible, but still difficult. Uh, because it used to be 11 minute mark for the incomplete fight. Incomplete one fight. Now it's 11 minute mark at to the end of the fjord? That's a little insane. 12 minutes 34 seconds ago. I'm doing the math right, right? Yeah, it's 11 minute mark. So to be able to reach that, you need to get here 11 minutes. And it's not completely impossible. Like we have seen, you can run past a ton of enemies. But we will also be running past a lot of upgrades if we want to make that happen. So maybe what we, we can do is run past everything and open that door. And then, I don't think I opened one of these doors. I don't think I opened this one. If it's not this one, it's the one. Yeah, it's this one. Um, man, I keep getting all these skill scrolls. I really don't want them. I want more strength, more health. That is all that I am interested in. Please give me what I want, not what you feel like I should have. I don't appreciate it. I mean, it's nice to get the upgrades and everything, but at this point, we have a balanced run going, which is not good. Balanced runs, at least in our past experience, is not something you want, but it's just the, the stuff that has dropped for us, so... Not much I can do about it. More damage on frozen targets. Enemies burn when they die. I don't have a way to freeze enemies. I would like to have it, but I think I'm going to pass. Keep on going. Mm. Now we just need to find the way to the upstairs so that we can have a fantastic tea party at the top. Boom! Doo -doo -doo -doo. The release the grappling hook is a fantastic tool stun everything but I'm seeing now uh, uh, vine shortcuts up there so there's some shenanigans going on going on here where is the way up <laughs> I'm just running around like a moron I'm pretty sure it's the next door after this teleporter yeah this is the one mm. stomp it just get the buff Macaroos! <laughs> Hello. Hop -hop. Get completely schooled. Get skill done. Spam attack until everything's dead. Huchu. Grappling hook. Also, I think that's something I said already. That it, it does uh, bonus damage to whatever you hook. The next. Oh wow! Really? Ooh, that could have been death. The sun explosion there, or at least. A one-shot hit. What's the deal? Oh, it goes down. Oh, you make a shortcut. That is nice. That's a nice addition. You make a shortcut so that way you don't have to. If you fall down, you don't have to. It's just uh, you don't have to go through the door again to finish this entry. Nice quality of life addition. Lock that. that. Oops, I used the wrong key. It's something that I am liable to do all the time. I am pretty bad about that sometimes. I was so bad at that with that on uh, with Spelunky that I had to put my bomb key binding really far away from everything else so I would stop using bombs when I didn't mean to. Oh. Oh. 
Okay, that was was supposed to be a block. He was not though. I was out of uh, range there. Ow! Oh my goodness! Up. No, I deny you. Just get wrecked at the bottom of the abyss. Filthy monster. Went through the door without dispatching everything. Just gotta spam attacks, even though. Bullshit. <laughs> I was spamming attacks and it just did not land on the damn monster. I really could use it, even though I have been using the shield way more. Still, I think I would much rather have. You know what? This might be worth it now. Bleeding target, damage on burning target. This dude. I think now it's worth it. Our situation has changed drastically compared to what it used to be. And now it's damn decent damage and a boon against flyers. So it is, I think, the right choice. Even though I love the grappling hook. Could not say enough. Having a great time. Ow. You asshole. <laughs> Just get murdered. Alright. Let's get out of here. Continue exploring. Continue trying to find the way to the place that I want to be. Buffer. Fire everything. Ooh! Surprise! Pirate man. Ow. No, no, no. Don't do it. Let me just block that. Good stuff. Good stuff. Yeah, the cooldown for this thing is just working really well for me. It's like shorter, it feels shorter. It's just the points of skill that I have. Accrued? Oh, for sure I would block that. The Death Orb seems to stop the cannons? Is that a thing? I don't think it's a thing. I'm just imagining silly, silly stuff. A tonic? No, we've got no need for that garbage. Uh, not this moment. You might find me in a completely different predicament. But we're out of heels. Uh, there's still places to find over on that other side, so we're going to continue going that way. The death orb, instant death. That is exactly what I want. I would rather have a secondary weapon that does that, but I'll settle for this fantastic death orb. A poof! A pop out! Stunned forever. Okay. Another shortcut. Open. Not like it matters, it doesn't matter at all. It's really stupid what I'm doing right here. Put this thing. Get that shit locked. I didn't expect that. I didn't expect that man to be able to attack through my amazing abilities. It's getting super wrecked. Does the damage buffer now buff the abilities too? I think it does. That is how they balanced it up. That is awesome. That is great. I did not realize that until just now. Let's do a test of that. Let's see. Death Orb. No buff. Damage is 117. Damage buffer. Death Orb. Yeah, everything's buffed. Fantastic stuff. That's how they balanced it. I was saying, oh man, the damage buffer is really not even worth it picking up anymore. But I uh, did not realize that that's now the case. The graveyard is here. I was expecting a <laughs> teleporter of some capacity so I could just go back. But there's still things to be explored. So we're going to go in. Not going to leave this this run in the middle. I have a history of dying in the graveyard in the most egregious manner. So we're just going to take this to its bitter end, regardless of what it is. Okay, it seems like I have gone everywhere, right? I want to say I have. Let's just go back there. The vines have been deployed, so I don't have to. I don't have to travel all the way back. So that's great. By the way, let me go back one more time. Okay, there's nothing else to the right. I had to verify. All right, good stuff. Let's get out of here. Oh, I called it back. <laughs> I was going to do a super fancy Northern Lion style super descent. Do 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 going into the most amazing place is the graveyard. We're gonna die horribly. Um continue upgrading that. What do I have now? I have this shield, which apparently cannot be upgraded. And I also have the nutcracker, let's find it. I don't have the skills though. So we also have skills the death orb. Pretty sure I have upgraded that. Hey, look at that. I only have four, I did not realize that. 
uh, to carry it that far. Uh, and I guess we're going to start investing. I'm going to get this because it's only 10. Why? Why? That makes no sense. Let's, uh, let's invest on this. It is time to start dumping all our cells into that particular upgrade because the money now has come back into relevance. I decided not to even bother with it because you get so much money that it's completely pointless to focus on it. But now the money is relevant again. You want to do it. So now is when I'm missing the grappling hook to deal with the ultra jerks. The death orb will be fantastic in this thing. Yeah. Fantastic stuff. And then kill them outright. That would be a good, damn good job softening it all up. But that would be great. Um, using it from here on forward. I had a thing that I was saying. Oh yeah, that I didn't decided to stop focusing on gold because it was no longer necessary. But now it's necessary again. It makes sense to have more money. Pursue money, happiness. Exactly the same thing. Oh yeah, health up. Please just explode. Health upgrade is fantastic. Love it, love it, love it. So glad to see it. Now if we can only get more strength. That will be great. I really don't need any more skills. Although the Death Orb is really doing great for me, by me, so... Um, I will not mind either way. It will be fine. That is my conclusion. This gets some death. And now... Kaboom! Pa -pa pow While I'm spamming the attack, they do not approach. That is smart. Little jerks. I didn't want to do that. Right, this doesn't look too complicated. We're probably going to find the key. No, we're finding a chest. Give me a good secondary weapon. Give me a better death orb. Poison enemies burn. Plus ten percent health. None of my enemies are burning. None of my enemies are bleeding. So we're going to go for that because it does set my enemies on fire. Another thing you could argue is getting both because the first one sets enemies on fire when they die. Nah, but plus one to strength makes the makes the decision there. I was uh, very much seriously considering, considering it, considering it, <laughs> but uh oh, but uh, the plus one to strength in the damage buffer that made the decision for me. Get that orb, you filthy, filthy monster. Oh yeah, those guys with the hook, they are just so. <laughs> I cannot handle them. I'm so bad. Uh, I just need to... I just did lead damage. Absolutely. Need to be better. Blocking better at dodging. Just need to crouch. Just crouch under that. Ow. Oh man, I am! That was bullshit. <laughs> I was getting, uh, getting caught. Get this orb. Thank you. Let's see. Block! That was pretty good. Ooh, can you crouch under that? Yeah, you can. Okay, good. You can also block it. But the cake! <laughs> so damn powerful. It's super powerful. They are really difficult to deal with. They have the super fast kick. Although I, it does seem like they slowed it down. I am, could be imagining thing right, things right now. But I feel like they slowed down the kick on those guys because it was just too damn difficult to, to predict. Uh, it would be a good call if they did. If they didn't, well, I'm just imagining things, and maybe you should kill a, a call out a, the sight guard because I'm losing my marbles now. That was a terrible mistake to drop down here without destroying everything that can slow it down. This filthy animal. Nice to block all these monsters. I was not blocking the monsters. Let's get the horde. Do, 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 do. Uh, yeah. Thirteen ninety-three crit on that. Uh, was it, I don't think it was a crit. It was just a whole bunch of damage. That's what it was. I think that's the technical term for it. Whole bunch of damage. That up, curse chest. Yeah, mm -hmm. That's very interesting. <laughs> Hilarious. Hilarious. No. <laughs> not gonna happen. Although, it is not that hard to lift the curse. Not that hard to lift the curse when you have these guys right here. Uh, with the death orb, they die pretty easily. 
so you have an okay chance of not being hurt. But the moment I take the curse, I will die. Because I'll just get flustered, I just get super flooded with everything that's happening. And just fail miserably at the simplest dodging. There we go. Oh, run into my death orb, please. So that you may perish in horrendous pain. That death orb must be the most painful experience of all time. Just getting swallowed by that dark vortex of matter and just absolutely atrocious experiences. It's just my mother-in-law wailing, going in circles there in, in there, wailing her lungs off. Like, you're not for nothing! I knew my daughter should never marry you! You are a loser and a piece of garbage! It's just yelling over and over and over and over until the orb gets depleted by its own weight because it's too damn fat! See, because my mother-in-law is in it. There you go, mother-in-law jokes. Never get old. <laughs> Please! Get everybody murdered. This is danger zone right there. This is bona fide. Bona fide danger zone. <laughs> bona fide archer danger zone down there. So let's not. The orb. Probably would have, that would should have gone way better. Maybe I should have made an effort to block. Maybe I should have made an effort to not be terrible. Oh, you get what you get, man. That was a lot of enemies. That was extremely difficult to deal with. Here's the teaser area. Not yet implemented. And here is probably the way to that key that is taking forever to find. Oh yeah, more health. Sign me up. Level 8 health is awesome. Let's give me level 20 health. Still unverified whether more than level 10 is possible. The highest level that I have is 9 so far. Oh, that was dumb. Somehow I avoided that. No idea how that happened. No idea. Let's not get greedy. I was like, oh, if I do some damage here, I can probably make it. Let's not be stupid. <laughs> Just give them a wide berth. Ow. <laughs> Arsehole. Too in tandem, I don't think I can handle them. So let's do that and watch them explode. My mother-in-law has wailed once again. Destroy, destroy, destroy. I don't think I had any chance to beat those guys because they were so nicely staggered that I had a terrible time being able to just get a simple hit in. Absolutely terrible. Give me that key. Give me that key. And you, there's something, always something down here. Let's find out. A grenade. Don't diss it. Grenades are amazing. Damage on burning targets. So we have a good synergy there. The death orb will make things burn. Then the corrupted power will... Uh, I mean, the grenade will make do a lot more damage. But I'm still counting on getting more strength. I'm still counting on this damage buffer. I really appreciate how it buffs also the death orb. That is, I think, a fantastic combination. So... We're going to keep with that. Let's teleport all the way back to the key area. Maybe this time I will not be killed by a single random enemy that I come across. That was one of the more humiliating deaths I've had in quite some time. Like most of the time when you die in death cells, well, you find a really tough situation. You shouldn't have died, but it's understandable that you did. What happened in this particular run that we did at the very beginning just beyond the pale. There's no defending that. My friendos. Alright. Obliterate this. That asshole. Oh, oh. oh no, this, this blocking. I think though, against bosses, blocking is so good. At least against the incomplete one. I don't know about the oh nice. Some beautiful friend get stunned. Love to find this strength scroll. Really fantastic. It's done, please. I need that to happen. And extra gold. Uh, buff and boom! Wow! <laughs> Destroyed! And I have no problems destroying every single enemy that we come across. Just getting those dead cells. 
absolutely no reason to teleport here. Okay, we have a slight gauntlet here. It shouldn't be too hard. Okay. A balanced sword. Balanced sword are cool. I'm willing to pay this money. Balanced blade. I think I'm willing to pay this money just to check it out. What what kind of nut nutcracker do we have? Plus one to strength. Uh, it's very unlikely this is going to be better. I'm still willing to pay just to check it out. Burning a... Yeah, no. That's too bad. I was hopeful. I wanted to give it a try, but... Certainly not worth it. Oh, that was a poorly spent. Death orb? The nutcracker will deal with this guy. He just gets stunned forever. Oh, shit! <laughs> Good kind of lucky there, not going to lie. Was able to not get stunned. For some reason, did not get stunned on the, the hook. No, don't know exactly why. Sometimes the hook stuns you forever. Sometimes you get wrecked. Sometimes you are able to not get stunned. What's your dealio, man? I don't like you. I never want to be your friend. Shove shield? That's a new thing. Hopefully we'll manage... Whoa! I did not see that. There. Um, so hopefully we'll manage to get to the collector. We should. Shouldn't be too hard. We're already in the, in the depth of this area. Huh? Some guts? I think I'm going to leave those there. I'm at the point where I do really want to optimize uh, all the stuff, so I might need to come back and use it. I have used my healing in the past, so it will make sense. I don't know why I rolled the way I rolled there. Go in the wrong direction altogether. There is a fumigator somewhere around here. We need to find him. We need to destroy him. That is not what I wanted. Thankfully, there's nobody around here. Because I could have been so wrecked by a, a bad landing here. Careful with the... Yep, there's a guy with a hook over there. No! <laughs> Roll down. Roll under! <laughs> okay, how about I block you? Yeah. But they don't get stunned, it's so upsetting. But the block does not stop them in any way because it's probably because it counts as a range attack. So it's not like a, a swing of a weapon where it does kinda stun the enemy. You were hidden. You were an amazing hide and seek player. Just do it, just do it. Okay, get stunned, get wrecked. We're just going to keep attacking. Yeah. Are you still alive? But this means I can go back to the for the the guts now. There, that should be good enough. Let's go for the back for the guts. Probably we'll find a dead end at the end of this only one. Don't want to don't want to die. There. There, that's what I wanted. It's not cracker, wild, cumbersome, and clumsy. It's still doing right by me. It is doing okay. The stuns... I don't think it will be great against the Watcher. In fact, I feel like it's going to be a real stinker against the Watcher with the super fast tentacles. It's going to be kind of garbage. But... So far... It's doing alright. To the point I'm like, hmm, maybe I should go back. Ooh, plus one to strength. We finally... I mean, the shoving, shoving shield is not great. We have a force shield that we've been carrying from the very first damn level. Wow. Um, probably this is better than the Death Orb. We're keeping it. We're keeping the Death Orb. It's not worth the money, I don't think. This is probably the way to the insufferable crypt. So that is awesome. Still love the name of the place, by the way. Absolutely love how exaggerated that it... I almost just killed myself. Wow. Maybe not drop blindly into spikes, that would be fantastic. I was coming from the guts. Ended up breaking even because I'm an idiot. Really, one of these, huh? I'm willing to risk it. Especially since I have a heal, I'm going to top myself off. Although one hit is... Eh, that made no sense to top myself off going in here. 1 million 20, that's great. And they, these are just uh, really basic idiots. If there was dudes with hooks here, I will be... Very mad. Obviously, that would happen though, because I'm an idiot. I got trapped by the guy, had to roll away from the guy. What is happening here? I don't understand. I don't see anything that's coming, so we need to use the death orb as a bit of a, 
That's a prismatic stone. Make sure that the fumigator is not hiding horrendous death. Please. There. Fumigator. An evil piece of garbage. Yep. There. Fantastic stuff. Nutcracker doing so such great things. 3600 because now we have level 8 strength thanks to the... We want to open not with the the downward shove. Thanks to the shield. Uh, to finish that, I need to get into the habit of finishing my sentence. <laughs> really shit. Somehow, did not get damaged there. Oh shit! <laughs> we need to maybe not die. Uh, get wrecked. That was a terrible situation to be in. In between, sandwich between these two. Not the kind of men I want to be sandwiched between. You're an asshole. You disgusting hookman. Yeah. There. There goes a death orb inexorably spelling your death. Hello, sir. I don't want to go down, I wanted to crouch. Oh! I should be shoving the crap out of these guys. Let's try and do that. Just shove them out of the way. Oh no! <laughs> I have no heals left. Okay. Fumigator. I don't know if there's somebody behind him. <laughs> I will die horrendously. Okay, there's nothing here. Hmm. That was so close to death. I should just leave. But I am too greedy to leave. I want scrolls. I want skill upgrades. Another goddamn fumigator. This might be my cue to say, you know what? The insufferable crypt does not sound so great, so so bad right now. Damn invisibility of those dudes. So annoying. In a good way, right? It just makes the level interesting. It's just difficult. It's my life real hard. That is not what I want. Stop doing that. Okay. I want to descend, please. This is a dead end! Ooh. I just want to... find... No! Okay, there's the fumigator. Oh, oh, oh wow. <laughs> I just want to kill that guy. Thank you so much. Get wrecked! Holy crap, this is a freaking nightmare! <laughs> <laughs> oh, so incredibly tense. And all in the name of greed, there is nothing down there. Just wanna find. Oh, a scroll. There has to be something at the end of all this. There has to be. One hit and I'm dead. I think the insufferable crypt needs to happen now. There's a shop. There's something. There's something. 21,000. Well, I think I got rewarded for my, my amazing greed. Uh, level 9 strength, more health. Probably the strength is the way to go. Maybe even skills. I don't know. Let's go with the health. That's like an extra 500 health right there. I think that makes sense. Still have one point of life though, so let's go to the Insufferable Crypt. Please, don't kill me now. <laughs> I would deserve it though, that was very, very poor play at the at the end there. Got super flustered with everything that happened, but survived, that's what matters. Barely made it, made it nonetheless. And we have now a shove shield, blocks attacks and violently shoves blocked enemies backwards. I don't even have the cells to unlock that. I do feel like the drop rate of the cells has uh, gone down. Let's just put... there, I like unlocking new things. Just get this. Absolutely need it. All right, let's do the Watcher fight. Wonder if it has changed at all. Wonder if it's anything different than what we're used to. Or uh, it does feel like the Watcher fight is pretty well balanced. The tentacles sometimes are a little bullshitty. The creature itself sometimes a little pushovery. Overall, I would say that it's a it's a good fight. It's an interesting fight. It does not overstay its welcome. 
Like so many boss fights in so many roguelites do. So, uh, not terribly resentful of it. I keep doing some decent damage here. Damage buffer. To my advantage. And like we have established before, we want to do even damage across all the tentacles. So that way, the super buffed ones only last a little bit. Go. Of course, that was the easy part. What is that attack? What is doing? He's doing <laughs> the weird. <laughs> oh shit! The weird uh, spin attack. I think he's just stunned. I see. That's cool. <laughs> he has an animation for when he gets stunned. It's pretty cool. Pretty neat. Oh shit! Just ate that one. But I have so much health that it doesn't even matter. Okay. So much health. This is stupid. All right, more tentacles. Keep saying what I'm saying. Oh yeah, this is great. Doing damage to all of them is exactly what we want. And the stun really works in my favor a lot. Maybe it was a little too hasty to, ouch, to do the damage there. Probably we're going to get, yep, those. But they are almost dead, both of them. This should be not too bad. Oh, you're not dead. Thought for sure that would be the killing blow. Yeah, we can block that. We have so much strength that we can block a fully powered tentacle. That is great news. Woo. Yeah. The death orb did nothing. It just <laughs> collapsed against the damn platform there. So that was dumb. Ow. No, he actually did not hurt me there. Not that you can crouch under that. That is fantastic stuff. Death orb! That's decent damage on the Watcher. Don't do it. Doing a lot of damage. That's 2,000 hit, uh, damage per hit. Okay. Maybe you can block through that. You can. I'm not healed yet. That is great. Do -do -do -do. I mean, I'm still one... Only one-fourth of health. You didn't expect that. Of course, things get a lot harder now. These tentacles are going to do more damage. Alright. So more damage. I don't want to damage anymore. The ones that are half health. Okay, now it's it's all pre-balanced now. It blocked. Ouch. I think I'm going to heal here. Oop. Makes sense. Don't have to wait until I'm super low. It's kinda dumb, in fact, to wait until I'm low. Let's well do that. There's one down. I don't think we want either the damage buffer. Okay, the death orb did the prop did the, the job there. I don't think we want the damage buffer. Damn, one of the tentacles is super high. Just super high on that weed. One of them is coming. Man, so much damage. Almost there though. Almost there. Coming! Hoo Can block. And in fact, I think we're going to heal here. Makes all the sense in the world. I feel like the... The salt shield is pretty damn fun to use. I don't know how good it is, this is fun to use, though. So there's... A, has that going for it. Alright, we are pretty close to vanquishing this fight. I'm pretty damn certain we're going to make it. Huh? Come on! <laughs> there you go. Okay, damage buffer, death orb, destruction. Did not want you to go away. You're kind of a jerk. Ah! I can only block a few. It's kind of dumb. Whew. Pretty sure now he does an insane amount of damage, so we don't want to mess too much with him. Okay, 21 damage is nothing in our current situation. Okay, ow. It does add up though, so don't be ultra retarded. Please, sir, will you uh, will you mind stop moving so that I, I uh, so that I may murder you? All right, this this is done. This is done. We have smashed his ugly ass face into the pavement. So pretty good this run. I mean, there was a little bit of incompetence in the graveyard. Other than that, I feel pretty damn good about all the performance. Pretty sweet. Get that new weapon unlocked. That was kind of dumb, wasn't it? You want to unlock something at the beginning of it and not the end of it. <laughs> so that feels really stupid. 
Oh, it's a different shape of a shield. Okay, then. Just invest those cells right there. Now in 13 minutes. But of course we spend those 13 minutes in... Um, spend those 13 minutes... Yeah, yeah, the vessel, blah, blah, blah. Roo, 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 roo. Those 30 minutes in the very very beginning, doing the failed run like a, like a moron, but we got a victory. It's all good. Oh, yeah. Now, I'm very much curious to see how the sewers have changed, how the ossuary... Uh, what follows the ossuary now, what kind of uh, new area there is. We have not come across that just yet. I am not in a hurry. We're going to find anything. Everything! Wow, that's hardly any money at all. Hope that you enjoyed that. That was a sweet, sweet run. I liked it a lot. And I'll see you in the next one. This video is now over.